The U.S. is in major trouble with Putin, and they're hiding it from you. For decades, the U.S. has enjoyed the U.S. dollar dominating as the primary currency around the world. This presented an opportunity for our enemies like, like China and Russia, who are actively trying to weaken our country's superpower status by promoting the use of their own currency, the Chinese yuan. Vladimir Putin announced this week that Russia will begin using the Chinese yuan for international payments instead of the dollar. Both times to meet with Putin in the creation of a new axis of power. We've got America's enemies led by China forming a new economic bloc. Watch this, share this video, and let me try to explain some very complicated things in layman terms. So, what happens if our economy and the U.S. dollar are no longer the world's do dominant currency? Starting in July, the Federal Reserve is introducing a new crypto digital currency payment system called FedNow. With the FedNow service launching in 2023, the time to start preparing is now. Here's the real reason why. Because it sounds great, right? Wow, the U.S., a cryptocurrency? How cool. Well, not precisely. You need to understand the two primary reasons why they are rolling the digital cryptocurrency out. One, it's to prevent losing our superpower status. More importantly, we would lose our economic dominance and we would right. lose our superpower status. And we could see inflation the highest it has ever been in our history. Exactly how catastrophic the abandonment of the U.S. dollar would be uh, as the world's uh, global reserve currency. In fact, Putin recently suggested using the Chinese yuan instead of the U.S. between Russia and other countries. And he's now even trying to get other countries, including BRICS countries, which are Brazil, India, and South Africa, to do the same. In fact, he's there right now. The Russian president, Vladimir Putin, has arrived in South Africa. The Brazil president, the Indian president, they all here. The most devastating thing that could happen is if Saudi Arabia uses a different currency other than the U.S. dollar. Oil has always been traded in dollars. They're actually considering doing under Putin's influence. Saudi Arabia? is also in talks with Beijing to do the same thing. To combat this, our government is considering introducing a central bank digital cryptocurrency. It will let people make direct payments on things they purchase using the government without utilizing a go-between, like a payment app, Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, those kinds of things, or even credit cards. And users who use this digital currency are essentially lending their money to the government by using this digital currency. Now, this will help the government collect funds to pay toward the over $31.5 trillion in national debt that we have. It could lead to the loss of our economic freedom. The government would have complete access and complete control over everything people buy and sell, and they could turn it off immediately. Stay woke, my friends, and follow me for more.